Hey YouTube, it's your girl here, Tammy C. Walker, the owner of Dreams Are Reality. I created this channel to provide light and love. How you all doing? I am doing really good. Today's video is going to be about the beauty products that I use. Before I get started, please hit subscribe. Thank you, new subscriber. And please hit the like button. Thank you. That'll get my videos circulating and percolating all throughout the internet. Yes, I will be turning 53 in a couple of months in September. And I just want to talk about some of the things I use daily and weekly to help uh, me stay youthful looking as much as possible. Look, can't defy gravity all the way, but we can um, you know, make ourselves look better. Also, due to COVID, I had started doing my own nails. I have my feet done, too. I did it myself. I do go get them done here and there. I don't care for getting my nails done as much. I'll do the dip and the no dip. I love no dip. dip. I've gotten it done a couple of times. It's kind of heavy to me, so I prefer not to do that. But the no chip I would do, but I do a no chip at home as well, especially due to COVID. So the reason why I do my own nails a lot of times is because I get lashes done. They can be a little pricey. I've been doing that for two years. I go to a salon and get that done. And of course, my hair, you all probably see. Um, I've been wearing braids a lot because I, I, I grew a very short pixie cut that I had for many years. Lost my hair twice when I had breast cancer, so I was totally bald twice, so I had to regrow it back, but I, I love the short haircut. That's my signature move, but I've switched now to, I've been wearing crochets. These are the Singalese twist. I've been wearing a, a passion twist, the Tiana twist as well. I have done um, small box braids last summer. I do quick weaves as well. So now my hair is to, I think I might break. I want to say maybe past my ear. So it's grown out. So in a few weeks, I think I'm going to wear it out. Maybe with a little bit of extensions in it just until I can get it to a nice size uh, bob. My ideal style probably would be a bob to my shoulders. I'm a little ways away. So we're working on it. Um, this is a switch for me because again, I like short hair for me, but I like these different hairstyles. This lasts definitely over four weeks, but usually about four weeks, I take it. I really like to I usually get my hair washed every two weeks. All right, enough of my rambling, rambling. You can zip past that if you just want to get straight to the products, but let's hit it. Let's get it. All right, we're going to start with what I use on my skin every morning. Oh, and I didn't bring my vitamins in here, Lord. I need to tell you about my vitamins. Okay, first of all, I use Cetaphil, a daily, I see this, a daily facial cleanser. I use it to, um, you know, get the dirt off. I don't do it at night. I do it in the morning. But that's how I do mine. I'm just, I have not brought everything in here that I do. I have a makeup remover uh, pad that I use for Neutrogena. I don't use it every day, though. But this is what I use in the morning. Let me stick to what I'm doing. Set a fill. You can get it at Walgreens, Target, Walmart, Amazon, the normal places. So uh, I've had this probably a year and it's still something in here. So it's going to last a long time unless you use it twice a day. My superpower is a new ultimate day. Here for my last. I want to read you all. Uh, this over these under these braids. Okay. This is a multi-performance cream from Avon. Good old Avon. Over 100 years. It's still going. Broad spectrum. It has the SPF 25. Even African Americans or women of color do need the sunscreen. And I use it every morning. So I'll do the Cetaphil. After that, I put this all over my face. I I don't mess with my forehead a whole lot because I'm, it's um a lot of fine bumps on it. Uh, you really can't see it, but I can. So I try not to manipulate that forehead too much. Just wash it um, face, face towel. I don't know why. It's been like that for like a few months. But the rest of my skin is okay. I will, uh, you know, 50 something. So 
Ladies, some of you all, if you hairy, I'm hairy anyway. I have to make sure my mustache is going to start to get a little hair under here. So I pretty much tweeze it or I'll get a wax, um, which I have to do a bunch. So yes, let me show you it is a new. I started using this. My god auntie is 94. She barely has wrinkles. She bought me this September 2022. Um, this is, of course, not the same bottle, but it usually lasts at least three to four months. I think one bottle, I think. So, um, yeah, I use this every day and it really evens out your skin. As you all can see, let me take these. You don't see no wrinkles, do you? Yeah, I'm going pretty good there. Okay, so I had to stop and go and get the Neutrogena Makeup Remover Soft Cleansing Talent. Bought it at Target. That's why I like these products. Like when I'm showing you, you can get some of this stuff at Target. Definitely the set up here. You can. And again, the Neutrogena, this is good to wipe your makeup off with at night. So I use all of those products. The Anew, again, is Avon. Order it online. I don't wear foundation, but I do wear a flawless matte CC cream. I think it's between $12 and $15. I don't think it's that high. This lasts a long time. I use the color Amber 8.0, and this gives me a full coverage. I do not use any foundation. That's all I use. And it, it doesn't look like I'm wearing makeup. I don't have the best lighting, and I'm in my little office. But um, yeah, this is perfect. I was using Smashbox for years. I love Smashbox. They made a CC cream or BB cream. They discontinued it. They changed it up because I used a black one, and I started using it like 2014. So I used it for years, and they changed it up. I was hard. They just... Did this like two years ago. So I had to find something else. This is the one that works best for me. It is amazing. I love Neutrogena because it's really good if your skin is real sensitive and all may. So that's what I use on my face. Since I'm talking about my face, I got so much junk in here. You all need to see this. It's almost hilarious. I use in the line of makeup, I use MAC. And this one's called Prezi. I'm not a lipstick wearer. I do lip gloss mostly. I like this one because if you want the dark lip, it will give you that. I just dab now. Boop. I do like three. One, two, three. And do it with my finger. And it gives me a little shine and a little pop of color. My go-to that I really use more, I just started really using it. Mac, I, had, I bought it. As, I think I bought a kit where it was like three or four colors. This is Avon. It's like a glitter. Like it's like a glitter lip gloss. It's about six, seven dollars a tube. I bought about three, but I won't run out. It has a shimmer to it. Avon. Trust the Avon. A hundred years of going strong. So that's what I use for my face. Of course, I use Anastasia Abra pencil with the art shirt. You know. I'm not the best with makeup descriptions, but with that brush. So I have very thin eyebrows, very. So I've been using that for probably a couple of years now, for sure. I'm trying to see which way I want to go now. Let me just take it on over to my bath and shower routine. I use Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Illuminating Hand and Body Scrub. That's vitamin E. I love this scrub, you all. The smell is invigorating. <laughs> oh, I'm smelling it now. I wish I could smell it. It smells so good. Especially if you love coconut, you're going to love this. What I like about it when you're taking your bath or shower, you just scrub it all over your body. I love putting it on the bottom of my feet and your heels because that's where it gets really dry. And you just wash, you know, wash it off with the water. And you're going to have like a little shine. It's going to feel very soft. It's also good for your hands. If you want to wash your hands and scrub your hands, your hands are going to be nice and soft. Ladies and gents, you want to have soft skin. Oh, it feels so good to touch. Even like, you know, my last guy, his skin's so 
Beautiful. That's important. You don't want to be touching on a rough skin. You are much too pretty for that. Much too pretty. Okay. In conjunction with skin, I absolutely love Stress Relief by, this is by Bath and Body Works. My God sister, she keeps me with this stuff. I ended up interning somewhere and one of my co-workers had it on her desk and I actually snuck some. I've been hooked on this stuff ever since. If you feel stressed out, this is good to keep on your desk. Even if you work in remote and you feel stressed, it comes in like this a glass bottle. It's a lip, lip, calypse. I can never, you lip, calypse. And spearmint. That's a tough word. To but it, it does make you feel better. I've been putting it on my arms too. And I wear light blue by Do Dolce and Gabbana. So combined with that, it smells nice. My friend told me recently, she's like, you smell so good. I was like, thank you. All righty. More stress. My god sister gave me this stress relief. It's the same as that, but it's a spray. You feel it stressed out. You come home, you're like, ah. Oh. And I can imagine this. I need to take this in my car because that's why I am full rage. But this is a stress relief. Oil mist spray, Bath and Body Works, same thing. It's all a part of aromatherapy. So if you go there, you'll see this. It's, it will make you feel so calm and relaxed. In conjunction, conjunction with being relaxed, I love the candle. This is Bath and Body Works, Cocoa Paradise. I also have like strawberry pound cake. That's on my burner. Don't want to tell you all this, but I live in a no burn apartment. Really not supposed to be burning candles, although I have a lot fireplace i'm just telling you if i use a burner now um like a little hot plate thingy looking thing i got from amazon for nine ten dollars so i put my candle on there you still get the same aroma this is now cocoa pear that smells nice stuff up now so i love a good candle especially for romance oh. i was blessed to go to savinte um, it's a candle making place here in Oak Park, Illinois, not far from where I live. And I made my own candle. I forgot what I put in it now because this I did this like two months ago. But look, I have my little wig in there. Look at the beautiful container. It came in. We got to pick out our own color. This is kind of like a gold color. My light is not the best in here. It's yeah, like a gold. Isn't that pretty? That's my candle collection. Due to COVID, I had to do my own nails. I swear by Sally Hansen. I do her two-step. So here's one of the colors I use. Oh, God. I'll put my glasses back on. Lilac and Samiac. That's a cute name. This is one of my favorite colors. And you do step one, which would be your color. Step two is the... Miracle gel that goes on top. I say they last like three days to me because if they start chipping, I'm going to end up doing them all. But I polish my nails in the morning before work. I, I ain't got used to it. If I'm on the phone with my sister or my friend, I just knock it out. So here's one color. Here's another color. This is like my go to color. Kind of like a pinkish. I just want to me today. Yeah, it's like a pink. And again, you're going to do your step two with it. And last color that I use sometimes, I've been using this for the summer, so blue. Wee. It's like this light and me, I'm fighting it out. Yeah. For blue and add that step two, you got yourself a pedicure and a manicure. I do have a tub that I use for my pedicure. You know that spa thing you can buy. I use that. I also put... Uh, Epsom salt in there with lavender. I got an Epsom salt lavender mix that I use for my feet. I drop a little bit of lemon grass oil in there and I scrub my feet real good, file them down, of course, take the nail polish off, then I paint my nails. Also, um, swear by this one, I've been using this one for years, Sally Hansen. It's an Insta Dry. You're in a hurry, but you got to be going on that date and you're going out with your girls. Still want to look good. You don't have to. Dang, I didn't have time to get my manicure. It's the dry. And it, I like it because it's heavy and it lasts too for a few days. Put your top coat. Put your coat on, on first, this, and then a coat on, you know, your clear coat on top. 
Yeah, I love this. This is on my toes and nails. It's like a hot pink. Is it called? Oh, I swear. Oh, what happens? I told you I'm my age. After 50, you need the reader, some people. I wear contact lenses, by the way, but this is for small print. It's called Beating Heart. <laughs> and they, they stretched it out like that. Like that? Hey, do you have trouble sleeping? I did. Sometimes still do. I swear by this tea. Beauty Sleep, my god brother, he bought me this when I moved to my other apartment. It was a package of different teas from um, Republic Tea. Yeah, it's right here. I should just read it. The Republic of Tea. This one is a collagen-promoting blue butterfly pea flower calming chamomile and rose. It's a hydrating hibiscus flower. You are having trouble going to sleep. Get this one. So you can order it from the Republic of Tea or Amazon. Amazon had everything. That thing go. Amazon, Amazon, Amazon. The key to my health is taking tons of vitamins. Oh, yes, I do. I do not have probiotics. I just ran out today. I got to go and get some today. I take a probiotic every day. I do that because after several rounds of chemotherapy, I begin to be very bloated. It's still bloated. I have to be honest with you all. But it does help digest. I don't go without a probiotic after that. And I've been doing that for over 10 years. I do all types of vitamins. I switch it up. Every now and again, I go to GNC and get the Vita Pack. Those are amazing. If you're low on energy, go to GNC and get the Vita Pack or any type of Vita Pack. Personally, being a breast cancer survivor, I stay away from iron. That's what I was told uh, many years ago. So I just obey that. Health by habit. These are just Target vitamins, women's multi. I use these. They are very affordable. I think they're like $10 to $15. They have vitamin A, B1, B2, B6, B12, C, D, E, Acai. How do you say that? Acai, Acai, Acai. 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 Biotin, cranberry, and folic acid. I like this vitamin. I've been using this one for a few months. This is a good buy. You can always go more expensive with vitamins. You can go as high as you like. They make some really good vitamins. In addition to that, I use a sea moss. You really can't see because they got their label all over it. I got this from what a burdock root. Yep, it's got a burdock root. So I use a sea moss. I use this every day with my vitamin. I do that in the afternoon-ish. And I, I kick off my day with a probiotic. I do three of the D3 5,000 I use. I think I'm over. Taking, I think I'm taking too many. These help me sleep, though. I noticed when I wasn't doing them as you know as heavy, when I wasn't using this dosage, I wouldn't sleep good. So I stick with it. B12. I learned about B12 when I um had chemotherapy. My fingers and feet would be numb. I felt like the blood was not flowing. Somebody told me to take B12. I've been doing it ever since. And it gives me energy. It makes for me, it makes my circulation pick up. Maybe it's on my mind, but it does. So I definitely take three of these a day. I also take them if I'm tired. I know I have clients in the evening, I'll pop a B12. They're good before exercise, too. I swear by my vitamins. I've been doing it for years. They really work for me. When I go and have my blood panel done, I check everything that they're checking, and it's always within the right measurements, calcium, carbon, carbon dioxide. You know how it has all, it has everything on your panel, stuff you don't even know. It's always correct. Nothing is high. Nothing is, it might be a little, nah, it's always right. It's all, You know how to give me that range? I'm always in the range. So I swear by my vitamins, drink your water, exercise, you know all that good stuff that we need to do. I did this video because I just want to show you, you don't have to spend a lot of money to uh, look youthful, to feel good, but self-care is the only care. Sometimes we look to other people to make us happy. We spend all of this money on SD Lauder. I'm not knocking anybody with the expensive product lines that you use. I get it. It's your body. You want to take care of yourself. 
Sometimes you can just go to Target, Walgreens, Walmart, CVS, and still get the same effect. It's all up to you. As a woman that is maturing, I don't feel old at all. At all. Um, I feel better. You know, as I get older, I feel more empowered. I feel better. But I feel like I have to take better care of myself as I get older. This is why I use all these products because it makes me feel really good. I will put what I use in the description, which is a lot of stuff. But um, I hope you use it. You don't have to be 50 something to use these products. Even if you're a teen in your 20s, you definitely want to pick up the bath and body work. Um, aromatherapy. Everybody can use some relief from stress. Even if you're younger, you have stress from work and school. Vitamins are essential to your energy. The Cetaphil will help you even if you have acne. Um, the nail polish is good when you can't get to the nail place and you want to look good for that day. Get you some Sally Hansen. That's some good stuff. Having trouble sleeping? Remember that beauty sleep tea. Drop me some comments on some stuff you use. Drop, come back though. If you buy something, come back and let me know what you think. I think you really need to try that scrub by Shea Moisture. You would love it. Men too. It's not just for ladies. You know, some of these products definitely for men. Because a man needs to keep he needs to keep his skin looking nice too. We don't want no rough skin, do we, ladies? We don't want no rough neck, literally rough neck. Tammy Sharice Walker. I hope you enjoyed this video. I had a good time making it. And see you on my next video. Bye.